Now let's take a look at how Bob Catter's Australian Party fared. It didn't quite live up to its own hype in terms of numbers in the parliament, but the man behind the movement says he's ready and raring for the next challenge. When Bob Catter blustered back onto the state political scene, he was full of bold predictions. We are going to govern this state. At the very least, he expected his party to outperform One Nation, which won 11 seats in the 1998 election. Let me uh, quote Bob Borbich, not one of my fans, and he said, this is Pauline Hanson with a cowboy hat. Well, I'll take that. She got 23% of the vote, smashed to pieces his government, and with another 6,000 votes, would have had over 20 seats. Now, she did that with no experience in politics whatsoever. We come here as a much more considered vehicle. You know, we're not likely to be slipping on the banana peels that the majors throw in front of us. But there were a couple of campaign slip-ups, a lost court battle, which meant Catter's name did not appear on the ballot papers, and widespread condemnation of a controversial ad. 76 Catter candidates stood for election, two claimed victory. One of them, LNP defector Shane Knuth. And in Dalrymple, um, Shane Knuth's got over 50% of the vote and has easily won that election. Bob Catter's son overcame Labor in Mount Isa. We came up against a juggernaut. Their campaign, uh, their funds and, and you know, was, was so much bigger than ours, but we beat them. We won. Uh, yeah. good. Let's have a good night. <laughs> But the party's state leader and member for Bow Desert was swept away by the LNP tide. It's been a fantastic honour and I would much rather lose as an Australian Party candidate that stands for something than, than win as an LNP candidate that stands for nothing. Bob Catter's already talking up his chances at the next contest. Do you want to um, set up Catter's Australian parties in other states, uh, federally? What is your plan? We're already planning that right now. And uh, there are most certainly three, arguably seven seats in New South Wales within our gun sites.